Yeah, I suppose for the guys that have moored for a while, you know, but they're they're doing their own bit, you know, they're wearing it for the last couple of weeks, trying to get used to it again. So I don't think it'll be a big a deal when when it ha when the matches come and they have to be seen wearing them. You know? It's great to, to be involved with a good company like Mark Sports, you know, and, and promote the helmet because, like especially for young kids coming up, you know, they want to wear a helmet that's approved by the safety standards, you know, and, and that's the most important thing that the kids are, are looked after you if they get a belt to make sure that n nothing will happen to them, you know. Well, I think it, it, ha it has to be done, you know, it's compulsory now for everybody to wear a helmet, so I don't see why, you know, it, it's no good in giving out and saying why should I wear a helmet, but that's just the rules, it's the same as the rules of a game and uh, you just have to get on with it and live with it. I suppose it, like it's a bit of a hindrance, all right, especially with the bars in, in front of your face that you might be able to see the ball as quickly as w without without a helmet, obviously. So, you know, but that takes getting used to, you know, they have to train them, train their eye, I suppose, a bit better. And uh, hopefully, you know, it won't be it won't be too bad for, for any goalie that's involved in my team anyway. But uh, no, it, it's it's the same for everybody. You know, I think it it's a safety thing more so than that. And, and that can only be good, you know. Yeah, I mean, there, there has been a little bit of resistance, I suppose, but I think most people at this stage realise why this is being done. It's purely a player welfare issue. It's for the benefit and health of players. I think at this stage, really, there's no serious opposition to the move now. We, we knew this was the right thing to do. Our own medical and welfare committee have been pushing this for some time, and, and uh, we have some very eminent medical people on that committee. So, you know, in a sense, this was an easy decision to make, and obviously we welcome the fact that we have support from other quarters, but as I said, our own medical committee were very strong on this, and that, that was good enough for us. Yeah, I mean, we want people, as I said, not just wearing helmets, but helmets to the required standard, and I think the scrapping scheme is a very innovative way of, of doing that, yeah. Yeah, that, that's the reason behind calling games off. We simply can't put uh, players or supporters or anybody involved in danger, so really it's a very easy decision to make, and, and as I said, we just can't go ahead in the present conditions.